Another day and yet another secret has been found everybody, that is right, a wreckage of our cargo plane has been found in one of the lakes in Solis, hidden deep in the jungle. I don't know what's been going on the past few weeks, but there has been so many easter eggs that have been popping up. Maybe I had contributed to that with the amount of views those videos are getting, but holy shit, let's keep this going boys, okay, let's search Solis, <laughs> top to bottom. And we're gonna find all the goddamn secrets in this game. That's right. So this one has been found by the Reddit user Edmar100. So full credit goes to him. Essentially, where you have to come is this Umina region. It is basically right below that sign right there. There's a lake right here next to a small little village. So you can obviously fast travel to this location. It's the Lago Peruna. Is that how you say it? I have no idea. And in this lake... There's a hidden wreckage of a cargo plane. I have no idea if that was put there by accident or what's going on exactly. But if we quickly open up the parachute, I might be able to glitch it out a little bit. And there you go. You can kind of see the outlines of it over in this direction. So let's dive deep. Uh, let's check this out, shall we boys? Rico has now become Dora the Explorer. I like this. This appears to be the back of the cargo plane, if I'm not mistaken. You've got the wings and everything here. There's a cockpit right there. And what's interesting, there's a bus that's hidden in here as well. And all of this has been modeled, has been put into the ground. So it does make me think that this was meant to be found by us. But what's kind of interesting is that there's two cockpits here. It's not just one cargo plane, it's two cargo planes. And I might be able to actually retrieve one of them. It's in this direction if I'm not mistaken. So let's try to fish it out of the water, shall we boys? Let me attach that. And let's do it again. Come on, Rico! Oh! <laughs> I kind of missed the second one. That is not the best. All right, now lift it. Lift it out of the water and look at that. There's a wreckage of a car here as well, which surprisingly kind of serves like a boat. And let's get it. Let's get it out of the water. Look at that, boys. <laughs> it's just the nose of the cargo plane. No idea what it's doing here, but like I said, there's cars here hidden in this lake as well, which I don't know if this has anything to do with the new DLC. I highly doubt it. It's probably just one of those things that they just wanted to fill a bottom of one of these lakes with a little bit of detail, but here it is. A cargo plane that's been hitting in there. Oh, you can see it very well right now. It's kind of hard to make it out, but you can see the wreckage of the plane. Majority of it is located right there. I think the rest, if I'm not mistaken, are just the rocks and stuff like that. But there's a massive object over in this direction that I kind of want to check out. What is this? Oh my god, it's another pe- wait, what is this? So that appears to be a wing of a cargo plane, but what's kind of interesting, there appears to be a wreckage of an airship here as well. Is that the case? Because I'm pretty sure that's the frame of the airship. Yeah, that definitely looks like it. Look at this. So not only is there a cargo plane hidden inside here, there's this as well. And what is that? Wait, are those just like ruins here as well? Yeah, there appears to be some sort of like a ruined wall. It almost looks like an entrance somewhere. This one actually looks like some sort of an entrance, similar to the one that's basically hidden inside the mountain, the moon base. Maybe just like shoot this thing open <laughs> or something like that. That's kind of interesting. And there's something else over there as well. What the hell is this lake? Okay, so you've got more pieces of the walls, more pieces of debris right here. We enjoy how the head of the cargo plane is just still floating about the place. All right there, Jimmy. <laughs> what you doing, man? What you doing? So yeah, this is pretty much the gist of it. This is where most of the wreckage is located. As far as I can tell, there isn't like anything hidden inside the wreckage. It's just a bunch of debris everywhere. So this appears to be a part of a wing, maybe, or something like that. Let's check out this lake closer to the town itself. Maybe we're gonna find something interesting there as well. So this place here just has a bunch of rocks. Nothing out of the ordinary as far as I can tell. So yeah, it is just basically the central region of this lake. Has wreckages of cargo plane, buses, cars, there's debris of, I don't know, some sort of like an ancient entryway or something like that? Or some sort of ruins? I'm not exactly sure. You know what? 
I'm gonna try and shoot that though. See if I can potentially target it in any way. Is that gonna potentially blow up or something like that? An open in any way? No? I don't think there's anything hidden behind it. I don't think this is some sort of a secret entryway to Atlantis. <laughs> All right. Which would be pretty amazing. I'm not gonna lie. If there was like an underwater bunker of some sorts. My goodness. Imagine that, dude. Imagine the views on that video. Holy smokes. But yeah, you can kind of see as I'm flying up here with the parachute, trying to glitch it out to the best of my ability. You just have the central wreckage. There's a piece of an airship there as well, as well as, like I said, buses and cars and whatnot. So it's kind of like an interesting location right here. I don't know if this basically means that there could be something hidden in these mountains. I mean, there is an airbase right there, so maybe those are kind of, you know, failed takeoffs. They just basically crash straight into the water, but who the hell knows? Interesting. Look at this, boys. There appears to be some sort of a ruin right here that's being investigated by this uh, very happy scientist lady. <laughs> I don't know what she's so happy about. I, th I think it might be her first day on the job. God damn. So yeah, like I said, I'm not sure if there's gonna be anything hidden in this location, in these mountains somewhere, some sort of maybe like a small little ruined city of something of those sorts. Hopefully what I found in that lake, or what I showed you guys, because I didn't find it myself, like I said, it was found by Edmar100, that's his Reddit name. Hopefully, you know, this isn't part of some sort of a story that I missed once again, like I did with my last video, apologies for that. I have completely forgot the story of this game, so yeah, that location was kind of new to me, I'm not gonna lie. But anyways everybody, that is gonna do it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed it, if you did, make sure to leave a like on it, subscribe if you're new to the channel for plenty more Just Cause 4 content. If you have found anything yourself and you want me to showcase it, make sure to just send it to my Twitter or on Discord, I'll make sure to read every single one of the messages that come through. And hopefully, if it's something worthwhile, we can make a video on it and obviously give you full credit. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you're going to have a wonderful day, and I shall see you guys next time. Take a goodbye. Bye-bye, bye-bye.